Welcome to Mona Lisa Tarot. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. This is your message for January 2021. Let's get started with the reading. The first card is of the Shamanic Medicine deck. And you got the Swan. Pulling the Swan for you, Cancer. This is your companion during altered states of consciousness when you meditate. Through the swan, you improve your intuition. You have the ability to see the future. You are clear cognizant. And this card is asking you to honor your divine feminine aspect. It is great that you allow the universe to step in to give you healing and transformation throughout your life. Cancer, this card is also saying go with the flow. The next card is Surrender to your intuition. And I read to you on the bottom, it says, Tune in to your inner voice. Be aware of any gut feelings, flashes, knowings, or aha moments that may come through to guide you. Cancer, if you get a sudden hunch, a feeling. It is your higher self conveying a message to you. Don't ignore it. Embrace it fully. Pay attention to your inner voice. The next card is Contract. There is a contract to be signed month of January, it's a legal commitment for a business deal or a job. It is a binding document of two parties. We see here two. The next card is career. Cancer, this is the perfect opportunity to reinvent yourself in the workplace. The universe supports your every step as you follow signs and visions how to go forward with this exciting opportunity. And it also says, follow your heart. The next card is two of air or two of swords. All previous cards are reminding you, in order to make a decision, you must follow your heart. Don't even think about pleasing others. Allow yourself to follow your dream. Cancer, remember, they would do exactly the same if an opportunity came along. They would grab it too. Don't make this decision depend on others. That's really important. The next card is commitment. And it says, you dedicate yourself to your beliefs wholeheartedly knowing that love is the essence of your very being. 
With a commitment card, you develop faith in yourself as you move closer to manifestation. There will always be others to, to question your priorities. Bless them with the understanding that your commitment is only to yourself and no one, no one else is meant to understand it, for it is your personal journey of self-discovery and healing. But maybe you can inspire somebody else also to follow their soul's calling. The next card and the last card is poised. With the poised card you feel elated, happy, thrilled in seventh heaven and you feel like you can touch the stars, the stars of success and fulfillment. Cancer, you're ready for anything right now. You got the know-how, the expertise, and you feel writing a brand new chapter of your life. Step, step into your power, into your light. You are in perfect alignment. The poised card and the swan have two in common in that also the swan is considered an elegant creature as it glides through the water with poise and have the same number. 3 and 9 is 12, 4 and 8 is 12, 1 and 2 is 3. You say when in one reading there are two of the same numbers, this is a life path reading. This is for somebody of you that has the life path number Three. With life path number three are very creative. They have great imagination that unlocks the door of creation. They're very good communicators and they love success and can accomplish it. They're very responsible and take obligations very serious. So life path number three, Kansas, I think this reading is speaking to you in particular. You will have a breakthrough in January. You have been waiting for this for a long time to come. Cancers, sir. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Let me know at the bottom in the comment area your thoughts and please subscribe and like my videos. I see you again in February.